I'm a woman, not a girl. You know what I mean, man. How old are you? That's mad. I've never, I've never, I've never met a female electrician in my life. You know, I did see one one time when I was going into oh, hold on. I was going into my inspection and testing exam, and there was one chick. I mean, she didn't not she she looked like one of them chicks that ain't into men. If you get what I'm trying to say. She was coming out. But other than that, I've never met or worked around an electrical, uh, a female electrician. I had one tutor who was a female who's an electrician, but. But yeah, I had one female um, lecturer, uh, tutor. She was, um, yeah, obviously a woman, female. A lot more females getting into it. Yeah, I've seen like some um, couple, couple chicks. What you call it on on TikTok and that? There's one. Ah, oh, is her name Kimmy? She she's an electrician. She's one one chick, one white girl. I think she's from South London or something. Yeah, I've seen her. I've seen her on um, Instagram. I saw her on Instagram before I saw her on TikTok because I had Instagram before TikTok. Um, yeah, there's a couple girl and that. One time I saw like a Facebook post. So there was this young girl. Yeah, this I men, men are so dirty. Men are such pervs. So there was this young girl, I don't know where she's from. She's from outside of London. Typical, like, pretty English girl, blonde girl. Like a young girl, like, 19 or something, isn't it? Typical blonde-haired girl and that, isn't it? But she, she, was, she was pretty still. And um, I don't know how these men was contacting her. Probably from social media, obviously, on Instagram and that. But the post was on Facebook. And... The post was about, oh, young 19-year-old apprentice is getting a plethora of rewires. Yeah, men wanting them, men wanting this chick to rewire their house. And I was like, blood, what the fuck's wrong with you? What the fuck is wrong with you? you so, because you think the girl's pretty, you want her to come to your house to rewire your house. You're a madman, blood. That's what I'm saying, yeah, like chicks need to be careful when they're doing jobs, where they're doing long working jobs in men's houses. Like, I met a chick, she was like a tenant liaison officer. This is in Northampton, yeah? And, um, yeah, me and her chatting, like, because she was working um, as a tenant liaison officer on the street where I've got two flats now, but at the time I only had one. And um, I kept on bumping into her and that. So I remember one time, yeah, we were standing up outside where my flat is and she said oh yeah man like um you know when i go to some of the men's houses sometimes when i knock the door and they open up the door i see their eyes light up and i'm just thinking like, like what the fuck is wrong with you man? and she said yeah one time she was in one man's because she was um looking at doing the windows yeah and some other bits and pieces and that and she said she was in some man's bedroom and she said when she got there, the man's missus, his wife, he's a big man, like 60 years old. He, the missus left and he said to her, yeah, listen, yeah, I know that's my missus, yeah, but if you want to keep in contact, let, let, let me. I was like, raw, man moving like that, man. Yeah, man moving nuts. I'm like, nah. That's why you're like, my girl, yeah, I could never... I would not feel comfortable with my girl working in some of these guys' houses, yeah? Because man, they will move normal with me, but if, if if it was a chick, man will be trying to, blood, behave yourself. Behave yourself. 